after Joe Biden demanded yet again that the country ban the most popular rifle platform in the country, uh, there has been a big push behind the scenes again to get Dianne Feinstein's assault weapon ban through the Senate. However, they're starting to eat their own. The Democrats. Uh, there are seven Democrat uh, senators and two independent senators who are holding out from uh, endorsing Dianne Feinstein's assault weapon ban as well as all of the Republicans, but they're eating their own Democrats right now through Joe Biden's funders, every town, mom's demand, and the like. I'm gonna tell you all about it, but before I jump into that, I wanna thank the sponsor of today's video, and that's LAS Concealment. LAS Concealment makes phenomenal Kydex holsters here in America. They have holsters that fit all sized items, large and small. They have some without mag carriers, they have some with mag carriers, and they have independent mag carriers. So however you set up your EDC, you're good to go. They have a ton of textures and patterns as well. And for more information, check them out at lasconcealment.com. I'll have a link down below. Thanks to LAS Concealment for being a friend of the channel. All right, guys and gals, I am going to tell you the seven Democrat and two independent senators who are holding up Dianne Feinstein's assault weapon ban, at least in the Democrat party. And then they're gonna try to beg and plead and bribe some senators to jump ship for it from the Republican side. And probably they're gonna go after those 15 that sold us out for the Bipartisan Safer Communities Act. But here are the senators that are under attack by their own right now. In no particular order, we have Senator Maria Cantwell from Washington State, Senator Cortez Masto from Nevada, Senator Martin Heinrich from New Mexico. This one shocked me. Senator Mark Kelly from Arizona. Independent Senator Angus King from Maine. Senator Joe Manchin from West Virginia. Another one that shocked me. Senator John Ossoff from Georgia. Independent Senator Kristen Sinema from Arizona. And Senator John Tester from Montana. As I said, there's a huge movement right now putting pressure on those senators to get in line and support Dianne Feinstein's assault weapon ban. Now, do I think it has a chance? No, I really don't. However, I didn't think the red flag bribery money stood a chance either until Senator John Cornyn from Texas decided to sell us out with his group of merry men. Now, yes, the makeup of the Senate is a little different since then because some of those senators were outgoing and uh, we have some new uh, fresh meat, if you will, in the Senate but the pressure is real, it's mounting, but those are the senators who are uh, keeping Dianne Feinstein's assault weapon ban from being a real talking point in the Senate. Uh, so we'll see what happens here. If any of those are your senators, maybe, maybe reach out to them and say, hey, thanks for not supporting the violation of our constitution and hold them to their oath. Their oath to uphold and defend the United States Constitution supersedes the, uh, the wants, needs, and desires of uh, China's Joe. So I just figured I'd give you that information because every now and then that type of information is needed to know when somebody on the other side of the aisle is actually holding up a, a bill or maybe, maybe siding with the Constitution. I know some of those senators wouldn't sign on to this, but some of them, like I said, that are surprising, I thought definitely would. Let me know what you think down below. And if you are into the Second Amendment, you love the Second Amendment, whether it's for you hunting, you uh, target shooting, IDPA, taking care of your family, taking care of yourself and making sure that your life continues, then check out Guns and Gadgets. Subscribe down below. I'll bring you that news every single day. And until we see each other again, be safe, stay vigilant, and carry a gun to keep you, your friends, your family, your community safe. Guys and gals, I love each and every single one of you, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.